Florida's sandy shores are in many ways the envy of a nation, but as spring breaks heating up, so too are signs of an intense red tide event. Manatee County officials in the Tampa area say they've already cleaned up 7,000 pounds of dead fish in just the last few days. They were all over the place. They washed up right around here on the shore and they're everywhere. Officials are using drones to get a better picture of the impact, though for many on vacation here, it doesn't take a bird's eye view to see and feel the devastation. I feel like I've gotten a little bit of a cough and a little bit, a little bit ill while I'm here. I didn't even know red tide existed. That red stain in normally aqua blue waters has visited Florida repeatedly in recent years. Scientists say it comes from a naturally occurring microorganism in the Gulf. It's just dead fish everywhere. But when there's enough chemicals or so-called nutrients available, it's like adding fuel to a fire. And that causes uh, this organism that is typically in very low abundance to basically dominate and to the point where it produces toxins that leads to fish kills and obviously that has a human health effect as well. Dr. Steve Davis is chief science officer for the Everglades Foundation. He says restoring Florida's wetlands can help filter polluted water and reduce red tide. For this year's spring break revelers, the algae is already having an impact. A popular fundraiser in Indian Rocks Beach was canceled a month out. We can't take the chance to put all the security deposits down and then at the last minute have to pull the plug. Now, many who just want a spot in the sun and their feet in the sand are dealing with a persistent environmental issue that literally has them seeing red. And if there is a silver lining to all of this, both state and federal officials have been making record investments in restoring the Everglades to help deal with this red tide crisis. Savannah, back to you. All right, Sam Brock, thank you very much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.